Hey everyone, this is Sugandha and you're watching Ready for SS English and I hope so y'all are well and y'all are waiting for my sessions. Yes. Today we will be discussing something interesting and that is internship interview questions and answers. These are the simple answers. Don't consider them as uh, defined answers. Like you need to draft yourself. You can take an idea from this and yes, you can draft accordingly. Fine. So I hope so you have seen previous sessions, so two sessions actually on internship. Like what is an internship? One session was uh, why you should do an internship. And second was uh, what are the skills required to become an intern or uh, what are the skills you must have uh, if you want to do an internship or what are the skills you can develop uh, while doing an internship, right? So I'll pin those sessions in the comment section. It's advisable to please uh, have a look on those sessions as well because if you are going to watch only this session like uh, internship interview questions then it won't uh, serve much okay it won't be that beneficial right so let's get started with it and first question is why are you interested in this internship and this is you know a favorite question like uh, for whichever position you will go they will always ask you this question that why are you interested in this job internship traineeship or anything else right so this is uh, this question is completely your own uh, question like you need to draft your own answer why you need this internship why you are interested in this internship but yes obviously i can give you a sample answer i can give you an idea that uh, how and what you should say while answering this uh, question right so i'm interested in this internship because it offers an opportunity to apply my skills and learn in a real world setting your company with its innovative projects and reputation for excellence aligns perfectly with my career aspirations i believe working here will provide me with valuable experiences and help me grow as a professional right so uh, but uh, before this you need to do a proper research uh, for the company for the profile and everything that's why uh, they they can ask that what kind of innovative projects you're talking about what kind of reputation and uh, what uh, career aspirations are related with our company like with this profile okay so you must answer this question after a proper research of the company and the profile right so let's move on to the next question that is what skills and qualifications make you a strong candidate for this internship again i have answered this question in a separate session that what are the skills required to become an intern but yes here we can provide here we can answer this by saying i have developed a strong problem solving and analytical skills through my coursework in computer science Additionally, my experience as a software development intern last summer enhanced my programming abilities and teamwork skills. I believe these technical skills combined with my passion for learning and dedication to producing high quality work make me a strong candidate for this internship. Okay, so yes, you can definitely have a look on the profile. You can research what all skills are required, what all skills relate with you means what are the common skills and uh, you can mention those are skills uh, in this question fine while answering this question now second uh, now third question third is what do you think is the most significant challenge our industry is currently facing now you need to do a proper research uh, before uh, going uh, for interview uh, for any specific industry like if you're going for a manufacturing industry if you're going for automobile industry means uh, if you're going for hospitality whatever be the industry you need to do a proper research then only you can answer this question because they are asking you the significant challenge and they want a proper answer to it they want to know that are you serious about this internship or it's just a random check or it's just a random click like uh, you're thinking that yes if it's cracked then fine otherwise i'll move to another industry okay so yes you can provide this answer by saying that uh, based on my research and understanding of the industry i believe that the most significant challenge our industry is currently facing is the increasing demand for sustainable practices and environmental responsibility now this is just a random question means this is just a random answer so obviously you need to uh, do the changes you need to draft as per your industry right so with growing concerns about climate change and the need for sustainable solutions consumers and regulatory bodies are placing greater emphasis on environmentally friendly practices this shift has prompted companies to reassess their operations supply chains and product offerings to align with sustainability goals right in the context of this internship which focuses on product development i see this challenge as highly relevant it presents an opportunity for companies to integrate sustainability into their product design 
manufacturing processes and material sourcing. Embracing sustainable practices not only helps companies meet the evolving expectations of consumers but also contributes to reducing their environmental footprint and enhancing their reputation, right? Again, you can say to address this challenge, companies can explore initiatives such as uh, incorporating recycled or renewable materials, optimizing energy efficiency and implementing responsible waste management practices. Now, see, here you have done a research of the problem, like what are the significant challenges and yes, you are providing certain what you are providing certain solutions to the problem not only you are quoting the problem or the quoting the challenge but yes you have uh, given a thought process you have applied your time uh, towards uh, you know finding the solution for this challenge right you can say they can also leverage uh, innovative technologies and collaborations to develop uh, sustainable solutions that meet consumer needs without compromising on quality or performance and uh, you can say I'm particularly excited about this internship because it allows me to be part of the solution to this industry challenge. I'm eager to contribute my knowledge of sustainable practices, creativity and passion for environmentally friendly solutions to help the company navigate this evolving landscape and develop products that are both successful in the market and aligned with sustainability objectives. Okay, so this is like you can answer this question by providing first of all uh, uh, doing a proper research and uh, just drafting a proper answer related to the challenge and then yes uh, exploring the solutions that what can be the solutions and yes drafting it properly fine so next question is question four and what do you think sets you apart from other candidates this is very important question because uh, this is uh, you can say an alternative question of uh, or a substitute question for why should we hire you okay so i believe my combination of technical skills dedication to learning and passion for the field sets me apart from other candidates i have a proven track record of successfully completing projects and contributing to team goals moreover my strong work ethic and ability to adapt quickly make me confident in my ability to excel in this internship and positively contribute to the company okay Yes, definitely you can uh, change, uh, you can use the keywords or you can change the language, you can uh, um, draft as per uh, your own skills. Okay, next is fifth question and that is what are the most important elements of successful teamwork? Yes, what are the most important elements of successful teamwork? Now, this question is very important because being an intern, you have to work with the team. There will be so many people, you need to work with them and... Uh, what is your basic understanding of teamwork that they want to know? Fine. So in my view, there are several important elements that contribute to successful teamwork. Now, first is effective communication is crucial. Team members need to be able to express their ideas, actively listen to others and provide constructive feedback. Clear and open communication ensures that everyone is on the same page, reduces misunderstandings and promotes collaboration. Secondly, collaboration plays a significant role as we discussed in the last, in the first uh, point. So successful teams uh, understand the value of working toward, together towards a common goal. This involves leveraging each team member's strengths, sharing responsibilities and fostering an environment where diverse perspectives are valued. Okay, next is trust is another critical element. Team members need to trust each other's abilities, intentions and commitments to teams success trust enables open and honest discussions encourages the risk taking and facilitates a supportive and positive team dynamic shared goals are essential for aligning team efforts when all team members are working towards a common objective it promotes a synergy and a sense of purpose having clearly defined goals also helps prioritize tasks and ensures that everyone is moving in the same direction okay next you can say accountability is also vital for successful teamwork each team member should take responsibility for their assigned tasks meet deadlines and fulfill their commitments to the team when everyone is accountable for their actions it fosters a sense of reliability and promotes a culture of ownership lastly mutual respect is key to maintaining a healthy team environment respecting each team members ideas opinions and contributions fosters a positive atmosphere and encourages collaboration. It also ensures that everyone feels valued and motivated to give their best. 
Now, next, if you want to summarize this, if you don't want to uh, elaborate this, if you don't want to mention all these points, then what you can do that uh, obviously you can cut short it. And uh, here you can say like this in the context of this internship, I believe that these elements are fundamental to achieving project objectives and maximizing them efficiency. Like if you have mentioned only the points, then you can say yes in the context of this internship. I believe that. Okay. And I have experienced the importance of these elements first hand in various group projects during my studies where effective communication, collaboration and mutual respect were essential for delivering successful outcomes. I am confident that my strong communication skills, collaborative nature and ability to build trusting relationships would enable me to contribute positively to the teamwork within this internship. Okay. So, next question. Next is what skills or experience do you hope to gain? This is also very important that uh, if you have come for a purposeful internship, you have come with a purpose or just a random internship. Okay. I hope to gain valuable practical experience and further develop my skills in this. I am eager to learn from industry professionals, observe real world applications of my academic knowledge and understand the dynamics of working in a professional setting. Additionally, I hope to build a strong network and establish relationships with mentors who can provide guidance and support as I progress in my career. Okay, next, can you describe a time you took the initiative to go above and beyond what was expected to you? Right. So here this question can be answered by obviously you can answer these questions uh, with your own answers and uh, you must do it like you can take uh, example from here and this, uh, you can uh, make several changes to it uh, never copy these uh, answers uh, don't think that you have to cram these answers and then you have to attend the interview this is a very bad idea okay so you must uh, take an idea from this and yes uh, draft your own answers uh, prepare them well and go for interview right so the sample answer could be uh, during a group project i noticed an area where we could enhance our work by incorporating additional data analysis. Despite it not being explicitly assigned to me, I took the initiative to gather the necessary data, analyze it and present my findings to the team. This added an extra layer of depth to our project and helped us uncover valuable insights. Taking the initiative allowed me to showcase my dedication and contribute to the overall success of the project. Okay. Next question. Next is what motivates you now? This is the favorite question uh, which uh, can be asked in any profile. Okay. So what truly motivates me is the opportunity to make a meaningful impact and contribute to something larger than myself. I'm passionate about what this is and that passion drives me to continuously learn and grow in the speed. In the context of this internship, I'm particularly motivated by the chance to apply my knowledge and skills to real world projects. The idea of being part of a team that is working towards innovative solutions and making a positive impact on the industry is incredibly exciting to me. The prospect of learning from industry professionals and gaining practical experience aligns perfectly with my career aspirations. One example of what motivates me is when I had the opportunity to work on a research project during my studies, I was able to deep dive into a topic I was passionate about and the sense of accomplishment I felt when I discovered new insights was truly rewarding. It motivated me to continue pursuing knowledge in that era and to seek out opportunities to apply it in practical settings. I'm driving by a desire to continually challenge myself, expand my skills and contribute to projects and initiatives that have a positive impact. I believe that this internship provides the perfect platform for me to channel my motivation and passion into meaningful work and I'm eager to embrace the challenges and opportunities it offers. Okay. So yes, definitely you can draft it as per uh, your own answer means uh, or your own situations. And uh, this is all what I can say. And if it's helpful, please do let me know. And I would be waiting for your comments in the comment section. So till next video, all the very best to stay happy, stay safe. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.